So on the screening form, let's say that, let's take a look real quick. You know that there's these basic fields like first name, last name, gender, ethnicity, whatever. And there's some fields, let's say you've decided to remove all the must provide value uh, text, which is an option. And yet you want every, all these fields to be completed. Um, you can add a descriptive text field with branching logic that will um, display whenever uh, these uh, are true. So whether the first name's blank and the last name's blank, gender, either any of these, it will um, display the banner below and not allow the submit button. So whereas before you can hide a submit button, um, this gives you a little bit more flexibility and so if we look at the record status dashboard and we open up a screen, oh, I'll just open up a new, new instrument. So now if I don't answer those questions, um, that's gonna show up, but, and notice there's no submit button. There's nothing for me to do here. Uh, and uh, once I enter the required fields, oops, it goes away and now I have my submit button. So if I don't have them, uh, I can't submit this until um, all the fields have been completed. So I'm going to be using this going forward. Uh, we're doing some scheduling instruments and this and that. And it's important that all the fields are checked for the scheduling instrument. Um, uh, so um, sorry, I just got a text. So um, yeah, this is this will be nice for that to make sure that uh, unless people select everything on the scheduling instrument that we create, uh, they will not be able to proceed and submit the instrument. And if they don't see this and they do leave, um, their record won't be saved if they just leave. 